Hello everyone, Mr. Zax here. Let's talk about interesting fights. Three minutes or less. Um, yeah, Gile Zhang vs. Joseph Parker. If this is not exciting fight, I don't know what it is. It's like a crossroad fight for both fighters because whoever wins could literally be lining up. If not, to be next in line for one of the belts or one fight off from the belts so yeah i mean both fighters are coming off from amazing performances i mean parker against wilder i mean what can i say there so people my thoughts are simple don't take any credit away from wilder or parker because it was a good fight when he landed you could see he actually hurt parker few times it was the teamwork and parker in the ring and the research they did and i would say quite a bit of tyson fury knowledge what he shared with parker because you know i told from beginning and then fury said himself he did it he actually helped parker out quite a lot sharing the blueprints and doing sparrings as i understand um so yeah i'm not taking anything away best win for Parker, he really is back on the top, and Zhang, two massive wins over Joe Joyce, uh, absolute devastation if you could say like that, styles make fights, and Zhang is 280, he's not cutting down, he's a, in my eyes he's kind of a bit a counter puncher because he finds the moment and then just lands the left hand through the guard, and that's what I saw, he landed multiple times through the guard, and then he follows up. He is like a four down fighter. I don't I'm not denying it. He's very dangerous in the first half of the fight. But I need to go with Chang as he's a much bigger guy. Maybe not as good as um Joseph Parker, but you know what styles make fights. And just a few months ago he absolutely destroyed Joe Joyce. So So yeah guys. When I was rewatching just now the fight, the first one <laughs> Honestly, I think Joe Joyce literally felt like people on the other end when he when they get hit so hard that they're like, what I'm doing here? What's wrong with this guy? Why he's punching so hard? Because that's how I saw the fight. Uh, yeah, it's like a little bit of like kind of shell shock. You're like, whoa, what's, what's going on? I haven't said that. I needed like a third person view. So I'm using bookies. I'm not encouraging any gambling and nothing like that how they see this fight and they are giving uh zhang a massive advantage i wouldn't go that far as i said before i think um joseph parker is better overall boxer but styles make fights and we are talking about roughly 40 pound difference guys that's a lot if he if he putting any other division 40 pounds we are changing three four five eight categories okay so yeah and this is the reason why I kind of slightly favor Zhang to win this fight uh, by KO or TKO, just like just pummeling it through with that left hand, eventually just causing TKO. Or I would say Parker lasts through those four rounds, five rounds, and then just steal the rest of the fight by quite easily just outboxing uh, Zhang. Again, guys, in my eyes, it's too close to call. I'm just so excited about the fight. If you're excited to smash that like button, subscribe it, and you know what, put it down in the comment section who you think who gonna win because I have no idea. I think this is just either gonna be absolute masterclass of boxing or it will gonna be slugfest. Anyway, I'm watching it. <laughs> okay, guys, till next time, Mr. Zas out.